You hear of a mountain and imagine what it would be like at the top. Amazing. Just like having a successful business would be. So, you start walking there. You feel like you're making good progress. You're clearly getting closer to the mountain, even if you haven't really started climbing up yet. It's a lot like you're deciding what your business will be about, what you sell, and so on. And it's clear you're moving forward. You start to see the mountain a lot closer, so you're encouraged to keep going, even though the road starts to get steeper. You might look back and wonder how much easier it would be to just turn back now. But you're determined, so you keep going forward. And soon enough, you reach a milestone that makes it clear you've gotten pretty far. So you celebrate that. Maybe even relax for a moment. But then you keep going. There are lots of signs telling you which direction you should go, and there are others going the same way. It really looks like climbing up must be child's play, so you keep going. But the road is getting tougher. Each step is a little harder than the first steps were. There are plenty of opportunities for you to just stop, or go to the easy way, or rest for a moment. But you keep going. But it is getting tedious. And that's the moment someone shows you a shortcut. You jump on it because it seems so much easier than the road you were on that you didn't even know how long it would be. And they seem to really understand you. It's like they talk your language. They tell you how amazing this shortcut is, how lucky you are to have found it, and they reassure you it's the right choice for you. The normal route is just not as good. As a side note, this woman, coincidentally, was Finnish. So she literally spoke my language. Anyway, you go on the shortcut, you follow the path or the instructions, and they're hard. But you believe the shortcut is worth it. The road you were on might have taken forever. And a great thing about the shortcut, the views are amazing. Or you see some results that look nice, even if they don't mean you've made any profit, but at least they make you feel good. So you keep going. But the longer you go, The clearer it becomes that the supposed shortcut is incredibly hard. But it's far too late to turn back, so you try to keep going. Every small step takes a lot of effort, but at least sometimes there's that sense of having done something cool, even if it's not actual profit, but you feel that you're getting close. You push through all the troubles, and you're really close to the goals you had. And then you look around and notice that there's a far easier way up. If you just would have taken the certain route, not the route that might be fast or might lead to even better results or might create some extra benefits, if you just would have gone the route that works almost certainly, your odds of reaching the top would have been a lot better. Well, at least the last few steps are easier when you just do things the simple, not so glorious way. But it does make you wonder, how much easier would it have been to get to your goals if you had done the basics right? If you would have really considered all the options with someone who knew them. If you wouldn't have wasted so much time going in circles, trying things that didn't work, spending money on fancy things that don't really help. If you would have packed enough water not to be thirsty most of the way up. So, whether you're starting a business or you just want to make sure your your road forward is as smooth as possible, start by going through the basics. Make sure that your target customer is viable and specific enough, that the way you package your service is good for potential customers and for you, that the pricing makes sense, that you describe your offer in a way that makes people actually want to buy it, that your website has all the necessary things, instead of a hundred unnecessary things, and so on. If you want a simple checklist that tells you what those basics are, so you don't waste time on an endless list of unnecessary things, Go to petersandine.com slash basics. And to be clear, every good marketing expert who teaches how to build a business will tell you these things are the basics. They might teach a different approach to them or organize them a little differently or put more emphasis on some of them. But if they know what they're doing, the checklist looks almost exactly the same. Because if it doesn't, then they're missing something crucial. So check it out. And if you want more videos from me, click the subscribe button. I'll see you then. So, what great wisdom did the mountain impart on me while I was climbing up? Uh, Get this, these are not the best mountain climbing clothes. I know, 